Welcome, in front of me is a Xiaomi 11 Lite and today I'll show you how to set up the portable hotspot and also use it obviously. So to get started you want to pull down your toggles from the right side, straight from the top and expand it, look for the hotspot toggle which for me looks to be somewhere, hopefully. Oh, there we go, hotspot. Now, for some reason, this says there is no toggle for it, like no image. Oh no, there is. It's just like super faint for some reason. Not sure what is happening. Like, you can barely see it. You can see, like, almost Wi Fi. But anyway, uh, you can obviously see it says hotspot uh, below that. So, if you have the same bug, just look for the hotspot and that's it. So, once you find it, you want to first time around hold it. This will quickly take you to the settings where you will be able to customize a couple things. Number one, probably the most important one, will be customizing your password. So when you tap on the setup portable hotspot, it will automatically select the password. You can tap on the eye to view it, but as you can see, the password that is randomly generated is uh, anything but easy to remember. So what you can do is tap on it again and simply remove this one. Now the new password that we will sell is select needs to have at least eight characters that can be letters or numbers or both it doesn't really matter there we go and from here we can change a couple additional things we have security device info uh, for location we have AP band and hide SSID so a couple things don't recommend you to turn off security otherwise anybody can connect don't recommend you to uh, turn on hide the SSID otherwise you will need to go into Wi-Fi, then scroll down, select add network, and you'll need to provide the name, the password, and everything needs to be exactly to that to the letter correct. Otherwise, it, it won't find it. Uh, the things that you can do is uh, just, let's see, info location of default of portable hotspot. Not sure what that actually does, but we do also have the AP band, which allows you to choose the five gigahertz. Now, uh, this does have benefits if you change it to uh, 5 gigahertz uh, the benefit would be and the hotspot connection would be faster and more stable but the downside is not every device will support it so because 5 gigahertz is a newer technology uh, compared to like the 2.4 uh, devices released in like 20 what was it like 15 16 17 i don't exactly recall but yeah some of them might support it some of them don't now the way you can figure it out if your device supports it or not is turn it on and if you turn on your hotspot any device that you're trying to connect to it sees your uh hotspot they have created with the five gigahertz that means that it supports it and you're all set if and if otherwise your device doesn't su uh, doesn't see it it means that it just does not support the five gigahertz and all you need to do is go back to the settings change that back to 2.4 the 2.4 is basically used by any device that has any kind of smart capabilities of like wi-fi connection so yeah i'll keep it at five because i'm not going to be connecting to it anyway right now and lastly you can change the ssid this is just going to be the name of the wi-fi visible on the list uh so by default that isn't always the name of the device so click on the check mark there to save the settings and find the toggle once again and simply tap on it for some reason it doesn't want to turn on maybe that's why it's grayed out oh yeah i just cannot turn it on for some reason uh maybe it's just be oh oh i know why i am in airplane mode there we go that would probably explain so i turn it off there we go, now, now it's looking normal. So I can now toggle it on from here. Now, last info that I will give you is when you turn on your hotspot in order to use it, you're done using it, do remember to turn it off, otherwise it will consume more battery on your device for no reason when you're not using it. And in the settings I didn't, oh no, never mind. there is option, so turn off hotspot automatically. So actually you don't even need to remember to turn it off because the device will do it for you after a period of period of inactivity but if you want to turn it off yourself obviously just find the toggle tap on it again and there we go it's now off so that being said if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching